of Mainers got a great view of the Northern Lights this weekend, and that experience extended far beyond the state. While it is rare to see the lights in Maine, it's even more rare to see them in states like Alabama and Texas. Meteorologist Aaron Myler explains why so many had such a great view and what it could mean for the future. The Northern Lights are something many wait their entire lives to see, and many had a couple once-in-a-lifetime chances this past weekend. Now, it all has to do with the solar wind, which is made up of charged protons and electrons from the sun. They travel toward the Earth and enter at the poles, which are the field's strongest points. Now, the electrons collide with molecules in our atmosphere, and this results in the different colors that we actually see. Green or red for oxygen molecules, and blue or pink for nitrogen. Now, the reason much of the U.S. was able to see the northern lights this time around was because the geomagnetic storm was extremely strong. NOAA confirmed a G5 geomagnetic storm reached Earth Friday evening and was the first since 2003. Now, let's get to the fun part of this whole thing now that we got the science over with, the spectacular light show itself. We got hundreds of pictures sent in, and we wanted to share several of them with you guys. So here's a photo from Wyndham. This was sent in by Allison Taylor. You can see it's gorgeous. I mean, we all got to really enjoy this one with all the different colors in the sky. It's been really, really fun to see all the different pictures that we've really had coming in from everybody. This is from Reedfield from Diane Smith. Lots of greens in there, so a bit more oxygen than this one. And another one from Palmyra from Jean. Even with a few clouds, still absolutely gorgeous when you look outside. It really just takes over the entire sky. And in Lincoln, for Merrily, it took over the entire sky and made it all purple. So even better there. It's just been really, really stunning. And last but not least, Carrie in Standish. A lot of people got on the dock there and just got to enjoy the Aurora and just made everything quite pretty. So thank you everybody for sending all the pictures. We've really enjoyed seeing them. And if you didn't get to see it, Noah says as the sun reaches the peak of its 11 year cycle, we could see even more Aurora in the future. In the studio, meteorologist Aaron Myler, New Center, Maine. By the way, you can see all of that on our website and our New Center, Maine app.